Maybe you remember your fourth grade music class. The music teacher probably told you about the different types of instruments, such as woodwinds, brass, strings, and percussion, but do you know how we determine which instrument belongs to which group? It has nothing to do with what the instrument is made of, as some might think. While you may be tempted to call a saxophone a brass instrument because it appears to be made out of brass, doing so is incorrect. The method used to correctly classify them is by the way the instrument produces sound. Once the way an instrument produces sound is determined, it can be placed in one of the families of instruments. We'll start with the orchestra's four families of instruments. The strings produce sound by causing strings to vibrate using three methods, bowing, plucking, and strumming. Examples include the violin, viola, cello, and contrabass. The woodwinds produce sound by simply blowing air, or wind, into their instruments. Sometimes the air is used to vibrate a single reed, as with the clarinet, or a double reed, as with the oboe and bassoon. The air itself may even be used to vibrate and cause sound, as the flute does. The brass family produces sound by buzzing their lips into mouthpieces. That's right, they blow raspberries into tubes. Examples include the trumpet, horn, trombone, and tuba. The percussion family all produce sound by either hitting, shaking, or scraping their instruments. Examples include the snare drum, bass drum, crash cymbals, xylophone, and timpani. These four families of instruments make up the orchestra. Sometimes instruments that don't normally play with the orchestra belong to these families. Such an example is the guitar, which is a string instrument, but rarely plays with the orchestra. There are even families of instruments outside those found in the orchestra. These include keyboard and electronic instruments. Keyboard instruments sometimes play with orchestras and orchestral instruments, but they are really designed to be solo instruments. They produce sound different ways, but always through a keyboard played with the hands, or even sometimes with the feet. They include the organ, harpsichord, and piano. Electronic instruments have only been around since electricity has been readily available. They produce sound in an artificial way through the use of electronic amplification. Sometimes you can have hybrid instruments, such as the electric guitar, which is part string instrument, part electronic instrument. Virtually anything used to make music can be classified into these families by asking yourself how the sound is produced. Next time you're listening to music that has instruments, see if you can correctly classify them. Be sure to like and subscribe for more music-related content, and as always, thanks for watching.